Good afternoon. I'm Lieutenant Will Ryber with the Aberdeen Police Department. This is a video media release discussing details of a police-involved shooting that occurred today in the 100 block of Hamilton Place. First and foremost, the Aberdeen Police Department would like to offer its condolences to all families affected by this incident. I want to emphasize at this time there is currently no threat to residents of the city of Aberdeen. This incident has been isolated and it is contained. At 10.36 a.m., officers were dispatched to a report of a suspect who entered the property management building in the 100 block of Hamilton Place. The suspect made verbal threats to kill an employee of the property management team. After making those threats, the individual left the building on foot in the direction of the residential apartments that are adjacent to that building. Along the way, the same su suspect encountered another resident and began to use racially insensitive language towards that individual that prompted that resident to retreat into their home. Police were already en route at that time, and upon arrival, the initial officer observed a male suspect standing in the court of 100 Hamilton Place. The officer immediately radioed that the individual appeared to be under the influence and was armed with a knife. The officer also requested that an officer equipped with a taser respond. Officers responded to that call, and they, uh, call, they ended up approaching the individual and began to engage that individual verbally. All verbal commands were fruitless, and ultimately one officer deployed a taser at the suspect who they believed was armed with a weapon. The taser did not have effect. At the deployment of the taser, the suspect then charged the officers. One officer, in fear for his life, fired shots at that individual, striking the individual several times. That same person fell to the ground, at which point Aberdeen police personnel began to render immediate emergency medical aid. Ultimately, the Maryland State Police Aviation Division responded and transported the suspect to Maryland shock trauma. The suspect currently is in surgery and is in critical condition. It's important to note that the Aberdeen Police Department has policies that govern the use of force and for situations like that that occurred today. There actively is an ongoing investigation involving evidence technicians, detectives, and a full and complete investigation will occur. There are administrative and criminal reviews that will take place to thoroughly investigate this incident. Most importantly, we ask that anyone that has information involving the shooting, video evidence, eyewitness accounts, to come forward and provide those details to the Aberdeen Police Department. It's important that those details be brought forth so we can offer a complete and transparent investigation. This is all the information that we have at this time. We'd like to once again emphasize there is no threat to our community and that the situation is under control. Thank you.